Drummond phlox is a species of flowering plant in the family Polymoniaceae, native to Texas and parts of Mexico. It is named after Thomas Drummond, a Scottish botanist who collected specimens in Texas in the 1830s. Drummond phlox is an annual or short-lived perennial plant that produces clusters of fragrant, brightly colored flowers in shades of pink, red, white, and purple. The flowers have five petals and a tubular throat and bloom from late spring to early fall. The plant typically grows to about 6 to 12 inches in height and spreads to about 6 to 8 inches in width. Drummond phlox is a popular garden plant and is often grown for its showy, long-lasting blooms. It is commonly used in rock gardens, borders, and containers. It prefers well-drained soil and full sun, and can be propagated from seed or cuttings. Drummond phlox prefers well-drained soil that is slightly acidic. You can amend the soil with organic matter, such as compost or peat moss, to improve drainage and fertility. Water the plant regularly, especially during dry spells, to keep the soil consistently moist. However, be careful not to overwater as this can cause root rot. Water at the base of the plant to prevent wetting the foliage. Drummond phlox needs full sun to thrive, at least 6 hours of direct sunlight per day. Ensure that the plant is in a location with ample sunlight. Fertilize the plant every 4 to 6 weeks with a balanced fertilizer to promote healthy growth and bloom production. To encourage bushy growth and prolong blooming, pinch off the tips of the stems regularly. Deadhead spent blooms to keep the plant tidy and to encourage more flowering. Drummond phlox is relatively resistant to pests and diseases. However, it can be susceptible to powdery mildew, especially in humid conditions. Use fungicides and maintain good air circulation to control this. By following these care tips, you can enjoy the vibrant blooms of your Drummond phlox for many months. Thanks for watching my video. If this is your first time on my channel, please consider subscribing. If you liked my video, please do like and post your suggestions in the comments.